have been not in the second page for a very long time since May, and I have not got any ideas ever since I did my last video on Miles Mania. So today's video is going to be um, memories of being in Team Miles, and I want to like show you all of my memories of since I joined Team Miles back in 2010. And let's get down to memories right now. Okay, so my very first memory is, well, this was about two years ago. It was like around March, I think. Yeah, it was around March. So my friend Penny and I were like making some mouse behavior shirts for all around the world, the movie. And when the day of came along, we were so pumped and excited. And we were both like, excuse me. So excited to see Mouse Behavior, and we were like fangirling while they're doing their documentary of of them having a really good time during the Number One Girl Tour. And then the next couple of months, when they announced the All Around the World Tour, we were like really disappointed that we didn't couldn't able to see them for well me for the third time and Penny for the first time because I was originally planning on going to see Mouse Behavior with my good friend Penny. Well, if you see her in my previous videos on my personal channel, then you should definitely know who she is. And I literally cried my eyes out. And I was, like, blaming our management on what, on why they didn't, like, put Massachusetts in it. And then probably, like, a few months later, they followed me. And then, like, around October, I tweeted them saying, come to Boston, please. And they say, we work working on it, Team Mouse Boston always shows mad love. Like, like, what do you mean by mad love? Are you lying or are you just doing this to like get Team Mouse Boston attention? I don't really know. But it did like got everyone in Team Mouse from my area that got their attention. So that was a really good bright side. And my second memory is when I went to the Closer to My Dreams tour. It was my last day of my summer school and I was so pumped. And I was telling about Trevor saying, I was like, excuse me, I need to get to my concert. Because like one of the students don't even remember like where to like get back to their house after the last day. And so they ended up dropping me off and then I went straight up to my room, getting ready for the concert. And I was like curling up my hair. Well, my hair was like a bit wavy, but it was a bit short, but now it's all like a lot more longer. If you can tell by the pictures, if I, if you see them on my um, collab team Instagram page. So yeah. And where am I? Third or fourth? I don't know. So my next memory is, um, what else? Try to think of a really good one. Oh yeah, I remember. So if you haven't went to the Scream Tour in Boston, which is they did it last minute, well, add it in general. And so much Team Miles has been like pushing themselves to the stage and then the DJ, the DJ was like one, two, three, step back. And then they were just, we were just all shouting for Miles' behavior to come on. And oh my God, we had zero chill like I'm really dead serious because I was so confused at the time I didn't even know what was happening and man I was so confused and everything like that in general and then after Jacob Lattimore came came on stage well I know it's a side note before MB came along so while I was there there was one girl who was screaming crazy and then I was wicked confused on what was going on because because back then I did not have Twitter and I didn't have no <laughs> sorry about my mi mixed up words um I did not join Twitter until the next year before anything that happened and I asked one of the girls saying oh my god what's going on what's going on and she said she got followed by Jacob Latimer I'm like what I'm like, let me see the proof. And I was like, oh my god. That was a really good memory. Even though it was a side note. But it was also part of the screen tour memories as well. And my last throwback moment is when... It's really recent. But if you know by now, I got... <laughs> Princeton... Oh my god, oh my god. 
I don't know how to explain it, but he mentioned my Twitter name while he was doing his solo Ustream. He was like, do you like One Direction? T Coops 5996. Yeah, I like them. I think he said I think they're dope or I think they're cool, but I don't know what which either one of the way. And <laughs> if you don't see my mom's media video, I did one back in May and I was so <laughs> pumped and my mom heard me scream and I told her what happened and she was really proud of me for letting that happen because I was tweeting Prince like um four or five times. Wait, I think it was two or three times. And I I still can't get over it. Like I didn't even know that happened. Even though he hadn't followed me yet, but oh sorry about that, my phone's blowing up. And it was really awesome. And my bonus memory is this is also recent as well. Prodigy and Santo, both of them followed me, including Mike. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. I I did not expect that to happen at all. Just like, so, so amazing. Like, no words cannot explain at all. And even Mike also Snapchatted me about album number three. And if you're not seen it, just go to mindless underscore media, which is on Instagram. And I did fill on my iPad like a while back and I was so happy. I was like randomly, um, what I was doing? Oh yeah, I did like a random video about like how much time I am for album number three and he responded so <laughs> I was like smiling the whole entire time. It's really awesome. And then um what else I was gonna say? Um oh yeah, if you're wondering how he followed me, he was just doing like celebrating his like I forgot what number of followers he has now, and I was like telling everybody to go follow him. He retweeted me and then followed me. I was like, <laughs> oh my, oh my god. <laughs> it was so awesome, and Mike, if you're watching this, thank you for so much for following me. I really adore you, and I cannot wait for album number three. <laughs> okay. So, thumbs up if you really like this little memory lane of being a Team Mindless. Like, comment, subscribe, or whatever you want to do. And all the links on my social networks and two YouTube, YouTube channels will be down below in the subscription box. Even my personal channel and the main mouse media channel as well. Okay, so I hope you have a good day and have a good weekend. See you guys and stay mindless.